some of you probably don't know or just different ways of how people use the fire. The Folded Arms Clan, born for the two waters that flow together clan. Um, my maternal grandparent is on Bitter Water and my paternal grandparent is uh, Black Street on the Running Tree Clan. Um, my name is Wayne Wilson. I was born in Fort Defiance. The modern medicine, the traditional medicine, which one, or can they be get integrated? <laughs> I think it depends on the individual. Um, like me, I, I, I consider myself an eclectic Diné. Like trauma, I try to deal with it multidimensionally. You can use native way, or you can use modern science way, or you can use another different way. My mom was from here, Pine Springs, and then, which is seven miles up the road from this place, um, Burnt Water. And then um, my father is from Nyese, New Mexico. And um, so they're gone now. They passed away. My parents passed away. Um, they were um, part of the boarding school. Um, I guess part of the boarding school experience. I experienced a lot of um, the alcoholism and domestic violence in my family. It was confusing for me, a lot of pain, um, trying to understand what, why, why is it this way. And My sister used to just take me into the room and say, you know, stay in here. Let's, she'd lock us in the room. And, and they'd be yelling and screaming, dishes flying, and all kinds of things happening. Kind of brought a lot of instability in, in, my, in me and, and with my, my life. We would go to Gallup. Um, my dad was working at the sawmill there in Navajo, New Mexico. I just remember some times where we were coming back and somehow they would purchase alcohol, beer, um, whiskey. Well, twice we were in an accident. One of them, uh, um, my mom went through the window shield and she almost died, but uh, she had a, a, a cut across her face. And um, my grandmother said that was enough. I want my grandkids to live, so she, she told, us, told them to split. There was a lot of trauma during that time. We went from living in a house <laughs> to living in a hogan like this. You know? um, I used to. I remember where my grandfather had similar to the same items that I have. You know, grandson. He'd say, you know, I mean, we're going to do things to here together, and uh, we're going to pray together, we're going to sing together, and um, need you to, you know, probably try to pay attention as much as you can, um, because um, I don't know how things are going to change. So. I guess in a lot of ways, everything's like a ceremony, you know. That's the way I understand it. Even breathing, you know, your breath, your heart beating is a, is a ceremony. Everything's moving, your blood, and then your, the chemistry reactions that happen in your brain, that's all synchronized with um, everything that we do. So, like, if we're exposed to trauma or something that happens, you know, a drastic thing that happens, death in the family, you know, things like that, it, it affects you. And so how do we um, overcome that? Uh, it, takes, it takes, of course, it takes time, but then there's these ways that we have to come back to to uh, pray, you know, pray, sing, and um, of course you, you got to go and use the herbs to clean and cleanse yourself, um, sweat lodge, you know, um, songs, and like uh, even this, you know, using the, the, the pipe, you know, we use the pipe, the traditional Navajo pipe, you know, and then um, I was uh, using the natural uh, tobaccos that we get. Um, I, my grandfather used to go with him. He used to go out, go get uh, tobacco, different types of tobacco that we use. You know. Like I said, they're all, everything's a tool and our medicines are out there outside, you know, trees and different herbs that we use. You know. They're all out there. It's our, it's our pharmacy. So we have to take care of that. You know. When you're not in harmony and balance with 
the the universe, then that's it's it's affecting you. It's affecting the chemistry um, happening in your brain and then in your body. So it's like it it affects you like trauma. Trauma does that. It throws you off, and then you know, you're not you know either not thinking right or you're not doing. So we have to reset yourself.